Where are you? You just ran by me. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. I don't okay. see you. I'm right here. Oh, there you are. You're walking down the <laughs> path. There you go. Okay. You want to come to my house? Sure. Ladies and gentlemen, Lauren Lapkus. <laughs> Very nice to meet you. Uh, this is this has been really interesting because I'm meeting a lot of really cool people, but in in Animal Crossing for the very first time. So uh, I, I love your work. You're one of my favorite comedians in the world. Uh, oh, and, thanks. Um, I'm very interested to see in how you decked out your Animal Crossing town. So thanks for having us. Yeah, thanks for coming. Okay, so this is my house. Um, this is my living room. I like it. It Thank feels you. uh it feels like very rustic log cabiny and then you have this uh like rocking chair 1950s like uh TV dinner stand here. Yeah. But but no television, so I guess you're supposed to just eat and stare into the abyss. And yeah, just stare at the wall which there there's probably nothing on that. I think it's my keys are on that wall. No, they're not yeah. even there anymore. So yeah, yeah, you just stare at nothing. It's a real like sad grandma little situation over there. And then you've got you can play bingo in the corner and do puzzles. Yes. I have a desk over here that, um, you know, one thing is that disappoints me about this game is that you can't pick up objects and interact with them. Like I couldn't play the bingo or something. I know, I know. They should put, and you have a, you have a, like a diffuser in there. I like <laughs> That's like kind of like an old folks puzzle room. <laughs> that comes out, I love puzzles. I'm a huge puzzle person. Okay, this is my bathroom slash um, laundry facility slash I have a kitty litter for a cat I don't have. Mm -hmm. and <laughs> What's, you have a director's chair. This, I guess, for makeup, right? Yeah, that's where I'm going to get my makeup done. And then there's and this, like a urinal. And, <laughs> and you can you can use the stove in the corner to burn clothes, burn toilet paper. I don't know. Maybe I, I think what I'm doing there is like heating rocks for massages or something. Ooh. Yeah. And then there's okay, a shower like that. Turn on and that's pretty fun. Is that an authentic Mona Lisa painting that you have in here or is it a bootleg? Um, it's a bootleg. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I haven't I have yet to find a painting that is authentic. Have you found any? Uh I got the Mona Lisa actually because I could tell she doesn't she has one of the most iconic faces ever. And if you look at that one there, she just kinda like <laughs> <laughs> Well, at first, I didn't know that he was tricking me with the sales. Flip, yeah, right? I mean, that's his thats his whole thing. That, <laughs> I, I don't that, like that. I don't like being tricked. Yeah. No, it's, it's, it's evil. I mean, we, like, sometimes it, like, the paintings cost so much money that I'm like, I don't have that kind of bell action going on. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I really like this room. This room's very funny to me. I like it a lot. <laughs> this is my bedroom. <laughs> okay, this is, this is really a psychotic room. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, I, you weren't kidding. Yeah. <laughs> I have security cameras all over the walls, and it, that, <laughs> that wallpaper is insane. Isn't that cool? Oh my god, that I is. I awesome. had like leopard floor and heart wallpaper, and it was really romantic. And then I got this security camera wallpaper as a gift from someone on my island, and I was like, "This is cool." That I've never seen that wallpaper around. before. <laughs> it's great, and it's I like that you can like you can lay in bed, get some gumballs, <laughs> and then just like surveil the entire town. <laughs> Yeah, and this is my, right here I have my little like tarot card fortune teller thing yep. on the floor and my jewelry and my little matryoshka dolls or whatever they're called. Yep. <laughs> and so then you have this, the electrical ball over here. I love that nothing in this room, or maybe like two things in this room match. That's nothing my favorite. <laughs> it's, it's truly a, a crazy person lives here. There's not, no rhyme or reason to anything. I think it's more fun that way. I agree. I've seen, I mean, I've seen like Paul F. Tompkins. You actually should go to his island if you can, because oh, I would love to. Oh my god, his is amazing. I should connect you because his is so perfect. It looks like someone could really live there. His house is so good. That would be. I, I'm I'm a huge old fan of his ever since like the Mister Show days. So, oh yeah. Yeah, that oh, was yeah. that was my jam. I would love that. Yeah, if you can set that yeah, up, it'd be amazing. For sure. This, this is great. Room. This one is the room that makes the most sense. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, I've been slowly collecting stuff for this, and I don't do anything in here, but uh, I kind of like that it looks cohesive. A very still... understated, <laughs> an understated thing I really appreciate about what you do with the place is the music choices. Like, if you went into a gym and this song was playing, like... <laughs> You'd be like, what is up with this gym? This gym's amazing. Yeah, I have different music in every room if I can. I need to get a new um, music player of some sort in my bedroom so I can get something going in there. But yeah, so that's the house. I mean, you really, that's it. 
That's I great. I have on my desk, I mean, my table in the living room. I don't know if you know. I know. That. And so you're, 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 you're working towards the upstairs and the basement eventually, right? When you start Yeah, stuff yeah. <laughs> so I was spending money on some different stuff. So it ended up being a lot of priority for a second. You, uh, you went all in on the, on the yellow brick road stuff here. It's, it's nice looking. Yeah. So Mike did all of this one, uh, you know, over the course of a few nights when I wasn't really into playing the game as much. And mm -hmm. at first I was kind of jealous, but then I was just glad it was done. So you're, <laughs> you're, you're sharing a town with your husband basically. And so you have to kind of fight over like visitation rights and custody, yeah. right? <laughs> <laughs> yes. And sometimes the, the creatures will like tell me they saw him and stuff. And I don't, I don't, it's very gossipy and interesting. <laughs> His name is Rat King on the island. It's like Rat King was here and he had, he had a, he told me a great story. And like, <laughs> I, like I know we can't tell you a story in the game. So I know this is a lie. And yeah. <laughs> based on the Ninja Turtle, rat, Ninja Turtle villain Rat King. Oh, that makes sense. I don't know if there's any, uh, you know, correlation. <laughs> okay, tell me about this guy here. This, this, this is like okay. a. This guy's uh, over the top. He is he like a matador anteater? Yes, and he's like, he's really, really nice, and he's really extra. Like, I feel like his look is so much. Like, he just has like that hair. Everything going on is like. He's very, he's very specific and has done a lot of work to his outfit. Like, and this is another thing. My other characters dress, like I can give them stuff and they start wearing it. I haven't tried to change his outfit. So I wonder if he would be down, but I kind of like what he looks like. So I, I don't, I don't think he, you should ever change his outfit. I don't want to like give him a weird sweater and like make it strange. No, or like a Santa <laughs> hat or something. He's good to go. <laughs> he's, he's already got enough going on. He does. Um, Okay, this so... is beautiful. You, I, I like what you did with the little icons in the ground and like to, oh, to denominate like little... a villager and... Yeah, I put them in front of their houses and that's the kind of symbol of the town. Mm -hmm. um, these little hoppy things are like the new rage. Um... Yeah, these are great. <laughs> <laughs> You put um, the. Uh, <laughs> oh, are you, you saying? I was gonna say you put you put faces in front of like their houses in case like they come home drunk and they're like, oh yeah, I live here. <laughs> oh no, they all have the same face. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't narrow it down at all. Uh, this is my campsite, so we, we brought we put the little uh, wood stairs here to try to make yep. it easy to get around and. When people come, we try, we made it really fun. Like for a while, there was a lot of stuff around there, like all the fun things you could have. And then I started thinking it was too messy because my my village was rated like two stars. So <laughs> <laughs> I went through and like cleaned up a bunch of stuff and sold it. I love when that happens because Isabel's like, we're getting a lot of complaints and you're like, who snitched? I know, like what is wrong people? Like this is fine. <laughs> this is a beautiful village. It's like, I think this looks great. And there's like some mouse in the corner of the town who's like, I hate this, shut it down. <laughs> Fire I know, that like, woman? who is that person? <laughs> Pashmina, uh, my goat, was trying to leave the other day and I got really hurt and I told her to stay. So, what's her name? Oh, Pashmina. <laughs> <laughs> I love how that you have you have like mostly Russian sounding villager names. You have like Olaf and Pashmina. <laughs> That's true. Oh no, am I being hacked? I don't know. Oh, God. <laughs> who's this? So, yeah. uh, who's this? This, pe this oh, penguin I with the Leo, I think is her name. Um, I she's like her. She, she's obsessed with celebrity. Like she, she's like she thinks she's a pop star, and she's always talking about like how we should think about our fans. <laughs> <laughs> I like that she's she's a pop star, but she's wearing like a like a sweater she got in the Adirondacks. I know. I don't know if it's because she's cold because she's a penguin, or if I gave her that and I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Nice. Come, nice come this way. Thank you. No, the problem is, here's something I'm really, I really need to figure out, but I'm kind of lazy. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to make hybrid plants, but I was told that you have to like leave a cross hatch of space between them and they can like, they'll start to form new flowers that are a blend of two different types. Have you heard this? Yeah, yeah. So the trick is you want to basically put a bunch of like dissimilar flowers next to each other and eventually they'll like, make love or something. I actually don't, I don't really know a lot about the process. I think that is what it is, but I, I'm like, I, I did all this work to plant the flowers as they are. And it feels like a lot to dig them up and mix them up. And mm -hmm. I just haven't had it in me. I don't know. It's a lot of, it, I, th I find moving furniture and everything like really time consuming and tedious in this game. And I, I get frustrated really easily. I like the part where you just buy stuff and put it down. Yeah, no, <laughs> until an animal tells you that that's a bad idea. Yeah. You should go to jail. I, I think I lost you. I don't know where you are. Okay, I know. Right. 
Um, I'm, do you want to, where are you? Hold on. I'll meet you at the museum. Okay, yeah, that's a good idea. <laughs> My store is amazing. I'm like obsessed. I, I love that it grew. Isn't okay. that the best? You're like, how did I live with that little, it's, no. I, I think, there we go. Okay, and the Able Sisters clothing store is my favorite place. Have you, do you know that you can talk to, the, to what is it, Sable over and over again and she'll finally talk to you? Yeah, that she's she's really shy, but she opens up. I really appreciate that. I like, loved oh, it. It's great, like little by, at first she's like, I'm busy, please don't talk to me. And then she's like, please go away, sir. And after a while she's like, you know what's interesting is my high school guidance counselor told me I wouldn't be anything, but look at me now. <laughs> And look at him now. Let's talk about it. And you're like, wow, there's a lot going on here. Like, I, I feel know. like I'm in therapy. <laughs> well, I was bugging her for like a week. And I kept saying like, I don't know when she's going to respond. Because I had heard that she would eventually. I'm going to the museum. I don't know if you care. Um, and then if, then I like, right after I said it to Mike, I was like, she's never going to talk to me. She goes, oh, hey. And I was like, oh, it's happening. This is huge. <laughs> this is the most socializing I've had in like months. <laughs> Isn't it great? Like it, I, I, like I'll take, I'll take anything at this point, but that especially is just like a new friend. I know <laughs> it feels amazing. Okay. My museum's probably just like everyone else's. Like, I don't know if there's any variation really. Um, no, they're all the same, but maybe you have, did you get, so you didn't get any, you didn't get any art, huh? The only one you got there's was a bootleg. There's nothing in there. There's <laughs> not, my whole, I just discovered that my art wing was completely empty and I was like, oh yeah. When did that guy come back? He will show up arbitrarily. Mo I feel like most of the characters outside of this game and many in this game, like the ones that just show up on your island are uh, raging alcoholics. Like Yeah, they're and, they're angry, they're confused, they're mm -hmm. they like, like there's a you know about Gulliver the that like bird that will yes. just wash up debt and he's just like my phone's broken and I, I had th threw a party and my friends threw me off the boat can you help me find yeah, my phone he bothers me because i thought he was moving in oh my god yeah. is that is this the guy or no this is the this is this flick is, i yeah. thought flick was the art guy this is the flick is the goth guy. lizard who loves bugs oh okay i have some work to do then today yeah so flick uh I, flick is definitely like hot topic the, the, <laughs> the lizard he and does. He's, right? Even right down to like the golf he's pants. He's got plaid whatever. pants, yeah. That's what it is. I call them golf pants. I think that's like <laughs> very disingenuous to the the oh, ska man, movement. I had, I had some plaid pants that I wore in high school. I was like, I'm cool. I like that you put you put the uh, Statue of Liberty down here. It's very um, yeah, kind of the really, apes. Yeah, exactly. You <laughs> nailed it. So yeah, I get really frustrated when that sailor guy comes in because I'm like, I thought he was moving to the island and then he just wanted me to find pieces of his phone or whatever. And I was like, he, and then he went away and then he comes back. I'm like, he, I have to talk to him a million times till he wakes up. He's he's wasted. It's not cool. I know, I know. He he's 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 very difficult to work with. Um, I actually have a I have a high end stereo on me. If you want it, <gasps> I do. I need it for my room. Yeah, take it. Thanks. Also, I don't know if you're into musical instruments, but I also have a synthesizer, <gasps> which I, want I feel that. like I feel that. like it, it fits in your weird gym. <laughs> you could do sort of like um, oh, like that's I don't, good. like sweat music or whatever. That's hilarious. <laughs> Go in the corner and work out and bang out some tunes. Here, I changed outfits. I forgot I had this on me. <laughs> <laughs> you did go with the flowers over here. Is this sort of just like a little like children's playground? This is a playground, but see, I, and I, this is my favorite kind of flower, this red one, but I really want to make hybrids of this. So I think I do need to start working over here to put the red and white together and see what happens. All right. Yeah, it looks great. And I like the, the, the fishing zone you have down here. Yeah, I don't know what this thing is. I guess it's to cook fish on or something. <laughs> <laughs> That feels like something Mike would buy, so I'm assuming mm -hmm. it's out there. <laughs> there are times where I just don't know what's going on, and I have to assume that's what it's like his. <laughs> yeah, that's the interesting thing about sharing the town with somebody is you show up and you're like, did did animals put this here? Yeah. Did my husband put this here? Do the animals sometimes put stuff out? I'm not telling or you the answer to that. I want you to. <laughs> I don't. If I, if I give you the answer to that, there's less mystery, and I want you to think that if things start appearing, that maybe it was them, maybe it was your husband, maybe it was ghosts. That's more fun. There is a ghost. I interact there is with him a ghost. all the time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he's interesting because he's always like, "What do you want? Do you want something you've never had, or do you want something expensive?" And you're like, "Oh no." It's a really I hard decision. I, it really I is. It off every time, and then I always forget that he says, "Like, I actually don't really know what expensive means." So here, I think of you. Like, he doesn't care. So if you pick expensive, it's not really even that good.
it's kind of more fun to get something you don't have. Yeah, I totally agree. Lauren, do you want to get a quick picture somewhere before I bounce? Yeah. Oh, here. Oh, wait. You show me a good spot. <clears throat> Let's do it by the Statue of Liberty. All right. I had a Godzilla down here, but I think Mike sold it. Where did he go? sold it? Yes, I was pissed. <laughs> <laughs> Where's my statue? I sold Even, it. It's like you know better than I do. Where did, it, <laughs> did he sell it? <laughs> I think we have to cross the bridge. I do the same. I'm like 200 hours or, in, or something into this game, and I still am like, which which beach has my thing on it? Yeah, I get very confused. Oh my God, how cute is that? <laughs> awesome, I love it. I love the coral just sitting in the middle. <laughs> Lauren, thank you so much for having us. Uh, it, was, it, was, it was awesome to meet you. It was awesome to come to your town for the first time. Uh, and thank you for showing it off. I really, really love your house. It's it's definitely like a little bit crazy, but like in the best way possible. Thank you. Um, remember, you can catch Lauren on The Wrong Missy on Netflix right now uh, with David Spade. And uh, you can go check out her comedy stuff, which is phenomenal. Uh, go appreciate it for great, great work. And remember, you can uh, also help us out by going to the World Health Organization's COVID-19 Solidarity Response Fund. We'll have all the information for you right around here or in some corner. Um, go help that out. It's a good cause and help make the world a better place. Lauren, thank you so much for having us. Uh, yeah. And good, good luck with Animal Crossing. Good luck with uh, Olaf. You're, you're <laughs> One of my favorite villagers I've met. You're uh, like he's very interesting. Yeah, the 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 Russian named Matador Anteater man. There he is. He's <laughs> he's lurking around in the background, just just pissed off and with wet hair. I love it so much. <laughs> Lauren, it's awesome. Awesome to meet you, uh, and I'll see you soon. Okay, bye. Bye.